Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Now, did momentum get conserved there? Yeah. Momentum got conserved because when it hit my hands, his, the energy from the volleyball transferred into me, and I, on a friction or mostly frictionless surface, roll backwards. But was my speed the same? No. No. It's sort of like the cannon cannonball system. I weigh much more, about ten times more, than the bowling ball. And that ratio, it, you can kind of guess what your answer will be because of the mass there. If that thing, if I weigh ten times more, and when it bounces off of me, it's going to be I'm going to move about 10 times slower. So if it's moving 10 meters per second, I'm going to go backwards in the opposite direction about 1 meter per second. Can you demonstrate one more time? No. Please. I didn't get All to right. see it. Now, come back over. Now, we're going to do an elastic collision. <laughs> an elastic collision, I'm going to catch the ball. Okay? So, again... Okay, in this case, the equation, we had two separate objects. I caught it and held on to it, and we both moved the same direction. What could you what observations could you make? That you moved. Was I as was I as, did I move as fast as the bowling ball nope. was thrown at me? No. Because of momentum, my mass now is combined with the bowling balls. That conservation of momentum has to take effect, and we still move. And if we did the math, you would see that the left equal the right. Now, here is what an explosion does. Okay? The explosion is where I have zero momentum, and now I have momentum because I was able to push against the bowling ball. Now, why did I move? Because you push forward on... So these red skateboard. Equal and opposite. Very good, Josh. Newton's third law says that there's an equal and opposite reaction. But um, somebody hand me the basketball that's over there, please. It's kind of flat. So it doesn't matter if it's flat or not. All right, Jenny. Genesis. All right. It's it's flat for a reason. It's to keep people from bouncing it in my room. Now. When I throw the, the basketball at Dallas, how come I didn't move? Because it's flat. It's, flat. it's not less mass, or it's less mass, but that doesn't mean less force. I could throw this ball, basketball as hard as I wanted to, right? Oh! oh. <laughs> it's flat, guys. Give me a break. Okay? Get back in. Oh, I'm going to class. I'm putting this on YouTube. It doesn't matter. Ready? <laughs> I throw it. Like I'm not moving. And that's because Josh, Josh kind of started it with mass, but it's not the force that does it. It's what? The mass. Inertia. And I, inertia. Guys, it's the inertia because this, this ball does not have the resistance to change that that ball does. Alright? Now, uh, thank you, Dallas. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you do like to catch flippers. Oh, okay. Mountain Dew. Okay. 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 Okay.